Good morning everyone. How are you guys doing today? I'm coming to you here from St. George, Utah and this is my first vlog so welcome. So I'm going to be doing a, a trucking vlog. It's called Trucking Life and it's kind of just based on my experiences of how I've became a truck driver to uh, right now I'm currently a lease operator for a local company here in southern Utah um, so I just thought you know it'd be fun to put out some videos there you can see wonderful St. George behind me but it's gonna be based on trucking life in general day-to-day -day routine day-to-day -day things we go through I am a flatbed driver uh, I do own my own truck. I bought my own truck back in March of this year, so I've been running it for eight, nine months now. Before that, I was a company driver. I've done a few things, and so over a course of a few videos, I'm going to kind of give you some history about why I'm in the trucking industry, kind of why I decided to follow a passion, a dream, something that's been in my family for quite a few years. So my dad, my granddad, they both drove truck. They were loggers, did some side dump, and things of that nature. Um, so I've just kind of, you know, when I started driving, I just knew it was for me. The minute I hit the driver's seat and started driving, I felt at home. You know, something I've never felt before with any other job. Um, you know, you have the heartache in the morning. When you have a job you don't like, you have that heartache. Do I want to get up in the mornings? Do I want to do this again today? You know, is this for me? Is this something I can do for the rest of my life? And that was me previous to truck driving. Once I got in that truck though all that went away like I don't have a problem with getting up in the mornings I love what I do I love seeing the country and I have a lot of goals in mind as far as where I've been and where I want to go now um, some of these things goals you know I haven't accomplished yet um, I have three kids that's been kind of bugging me dad why don't you put out a YouTube video or a YouTube channel kind of expressing your concerns, expressing the stuff that you've seen, the stuff you've went through. And so that's what this channel is going to be based on. It's going to be based on the daily life of a truck driver, not just in trucking, but, you know, the way I am with my kids, what I do when I'm off, you know, what we do when we're off, you know, things we like to do for fun, places we like to eat places we like to go. Um, currently you can see I'm on a little place called the Red Hill in St. George, Utah. Um, it's a place that me and my kids like to come and go hiking. So if you see up here, kind of behind me, I can't even see my finger right there. There's some hills over there. There's a like a, a garden you can go walk around. You can actually go do some hiking and stuff and some repelling on one of the hills over here and as you can see there's a pretty big drop off right here behind me but this is St. George Utah for any of you drivers who haven't been through southern Utah it's the red desert so it's a pretty chilly day today not sure exactly what the temperature is but it's cold enough that I'm wearing a hoodie but um, as you can also see, behind me I'm in my personal vehicle. My truck's actually, oh, out beyond that hill out there. You might be able to see it. Well, maybe if you got a telescope and looked really closely. But it's out there in my yard. Or, well, the yard that I'm leased onto. Hopefully they're washing it because I parked it right in front of the wash bay with a sticker that says wash me on it so but it's pretty dirty um, so prior to truck driving I I did tile for for quite a few years 
uh, tile installation. I owned a tile installation company. And it was, you know, it did okay. It, it wasn't crazy successful. It wasn't, you know, it didn't do bad. I covered my bills and stuff, but, but at the same time, you know, my body was given out. My back was breaking. You know, that's hard work. And so I decided in um, July of 2015, yes, I'm a baby as far as the trucking industry is concerned. I've only been driving since um, I went to school. I went to um, truck driving school in Salt Lake City in uh, August of 2015 and then started driving straight out of there. So, I mean, I'm still a baby as far as, you know, I've only been doing it just over two years now. But, you know, my my passion and my drive for getting into truck driving, so for you guys that have been up into Northern Utah in the Provo area, there's a little trucking company off the side of the road. It's called Blaine Evans Trucking, or Blaine Evans and Son Trucking. Well, for you guys that want to know or care to know, my name is Blaine Evans. Now, is it my trucking company? Do I have any relation to it? No, I don't. It's just I have family that lives up there. And so as a kid, we would drive by it, and it was just awesome, right? You know, a little kid, you see your name on a, on a trucking company sign, and I just, you know... I wanted to own a trucking company. That's what I wanted to do. And so my motivation behind quitting tile and moving into the trucking industry was, you know, my ultimate goal is to own a trucking company. Now, I've hit a few of those goals. Like I said, back in March, I was able to go down to uh, Aero Truck Sales in Phoenix, Arizona and work with them and I was able to pick up a 2012 Volvo V&L 670. Um, and so then the company that I was working for as a as a company driver said that they would hire me on as a lease operator and um, even though I went out and got my own truck you know I financed it I pay the bills all that kind of stuff I don't really call myself an owner operator too much um, I like to set little goals and so I think of myself as a lease operator one of my next goals will be you know eventually uh, working on getting my authority and that kind of thing and then I will at that point that will be another goal and then I'll probably start calling myself an owner operator due to the fact then I will be completely operating and owning my truck and my business. For right now I'm leased on to a local company here and I pay all the bills but they find the loads you know they still essentially tell me where I'm going I don't get a whole lot of choice in that but I just wanted to make this relatively short introduction video um, the next few videos I am going to be going over um, kind of how I got my truck where I got my truck um, you know where I went to school you know the things that I did to become a truck driver uh, the things I did as a company driver and then also the things that led me to be be able to buy my own truck and become a lease operator and uh, kind of essentially do a few videos get you guys kind caught up on where I'm at and then you know maybe it will help some of you guys out maybe you guys can leave some comments down below and help me out you know so I want this channel to be you know a positive channel that's what I'm about positive hitting goals setting goals you know making your goals work um, so with that, I am going to go pick up my youngest daughter. It is Christmas vacation. So today is the morning of the 28th. And so I'm going to go pick her up. She's going to 
ride with me. We're going to head out to Denver, do a loop back around to Salt Lake, and then come back down here to southern Utah. And I will grab another load, and I think that load is going to Washington State. So, um, I hope you guys will all end up liking the content. So, like I said, it's not going to be just for truck drivers, you know. We're going to do daily life, but, you know, the majority of it is going to be trucking related and how trucking affects my life and the things I do in my life and the goals I have set. And, you know, I want people to follow along as I hit these goals and, you know, hopefully I can help some other people accomplish their goals as well. But I am going to leave you guys with that. I'm going to go grab my daughter, grab my truck, and head on out of town. But wish you all the best, and I will see you all really soon. Goodbye.